Let's graph the linear equation y equals 1 half x plus 3. And we're going to do it two ways. First, we'll put values in for x here and then figure out the values for y and then plot those points. Next, we'll check our work with slope intercept formula. So let's plot some points here on our graph. If we put 1 in for x, 1 half times 1, that's 1 half, plus 3, that's 3 and a half. And we want to choose values that will show up on our graph. We don't want stuff way out here. So how about 0? 1 half times 0, that would give us 0 plus 3, that's 3, and then negative 1. 1 half times negative 1, that's negative 1 half plus 3, we'll get 2 and a half. So these are the points we'll put on our graph here for the equation y equals 1 half x plus 3. So we have x is 1, y is 3 and a half. So here's 1 and we go up 3 and a half. We have x is 0 and y is 3, so we find x is 0 y is 3, x is negative 1, y is 2 and a half. So we have negative 1 and 2 and a half. And there's our line. We could have done it with just two points, but it's nice to have three in case you make an error. Let's put a line through this. And then we'll put arrows out here to show that this goes to infinity. Now we can check our work with slope intercept formula. So we have y equals mx plus b. b is the y intercept. That's 3. So if we go to our graph and we find 3, that's the y-intercept, that's where the line should cross, and right there it is. Same as our other point, which makes sense. For 1 over 2, the slope, we can think of that as rise over run. So we go to the y-intercept, we rise 1 and go over 1, 2. That's right on our line. From there we could rise 1, go over 2, and rise 1, go over 2. These points are all on our line. Likewise, we could go in the opposite direction, go to that y-intercept, go down 1 and over 2, down 1, over 2. All these points, they're also on our line. So this is the correct graph for y equals 1 half x plus 3. We could put different values in for x, get our values for y and plot those. They'd be on the line as well. This is Dr. B with the graph for the linear equation y equals 1 half x plus 3. Thanks for watching.